A new state law is now in effect, one that will help out a lot of families on some of the most expensive products that your baby uses every day. It's similar to the sales tax holiday for back to school shopping, except this sales tax holiday never ends for some baby related items. Two News reporter Leah Seabrooks is asking parents how this new tax exemption will help them. Ohio is the 19th state to make some essential baby items tax free permanently. This new tax exemption law includes big ticket items like strollers, cribs and booster seats and your baby's diapers. Everything for a new baby is so expensive. Parents like Hope Maston are rejoicing now that there will be some financial relief for things like diapers. A newborn can go through an average of 12 in one day and more than 300 in one month. So man, you're saving almost probably about $100 a day with the tax free. Like you're saving a lot of money, a lot of money. According to the National Diaper Network, the average price of a pack of diapers in 2019 was $16.54. In 2023, they report that price has risen to $21.90. It's going to make things a lot easier. I'm a lot better, I'm a lot more cost efficient because you have to equate daycare and expenses like that. Like, so you're going to save a lot of money. Other tax free items include collapsible, jogging, and convertible strollers, as well as booster seats and child restraint devices for your vehicle. Therapeutic and preventative creams that are topical and marketed primarily for the use of children are also tax exempt. Experts estimate this new law could save Ohioans between 13 and $18 million annually. So I wish they would have did this five years ago, but this is awesome. This is awesome. And I feel like every new mother, take advantage of it. Take advantage of it. And even if you're not a new mother, because my daughter's still in a booster seat, um, still take advantage of it. Like save as much money as you can when you can. So yeah, this is awesome. If you are charged tax for these items wrongfully and would like to request a refund, you can apply to get that refund at tax.ohio.gov. We've got links to that on our website, wdtn.com. Be sure to keep your proof of payment so you can fill out those correct forms. In studio, Aaliyah Seabrooks, 2 News.